The actions of a irresponsible Australian corporation by the name of Linus, whose headquarters is behind us. Linus has built a, a rare earth refinery in the city near the city of Kuantan in Malaysia, totally against the wishes of the residents of the area. They have said no over and over again to this refinery. And the reason for this is that Rare earth refinery is a very, very toxic process. Currently, most of the rare earths are refined in China, and the legacy, the environmental legacy of this is horrific. Entire villages have been depopulated as a result of this refining. Now, the company says that they are best practice and they have more modern equipment and more modern methods and everything will be safe. But the people of Malaysia don't believe this. The main reason that Linus wants to refine it in Malaysia and not in Australia is to save costs by its own admission. It wants to do it on the cheap. In fact, it's doing it so much on the cheap that it's got a tax-free holiday in Malaysia. It's not going to pay any cents in taxes. On top of that, it has been given the temporary license to operate with no proper environmental study. No proper environmental impact study on what, what will happen. Now the people of Malaysia are very unhappy about this and have been protesting uh, for months and months, for years actually, against the building of this refinery. There have been demonstrations, huge demonstrations across the country and in Kuantan itself, a very populous place nearby. There have been legal challenges, there are two current legal challenges in the courts against this temporary operation uh, license that Linus has been given. Linus says it's going to start refining the ore in October. But as far as we know, no ore has got to Malaysia yet from Australia. And that there's no export license for this ore. It's stockpiled somewhere near Fremantle, ready to go. Now one reason why the Malaysian people and the residents of Kuantan, the town near where the refinery is going to build, are so worried and angry about this. It's not just that they haven't been asked for their consent. It's not just that they haven't, uh, there hasn't been the proper environmental uh, impact studies done, but they've had a terrible experience in Malaysia before with a previous rare earth refinery built by another multinational corporation by the name of Mitsubishi. Everybody knows the name. In 1979, they started a refinery in the small town of Bukit Mera. And the cost of this was horrific. Local villagers started to find that their children were being born with deformities. The rate of leukemia and other uh, radioactive related uh, illnesses began to rise astronomically. Many of these people who got leukemia are now dead. There was a 20 year 20 year residence campaign to stop this refinery in Bukit Mera. You must go, Linus, Linus, you must go. People of Malaysia have said no. People of Malaysia have said no. Linus, Linus, here's our case. Linus, Linus, here's our case. People don't like your toxic waste. 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 People of Malaysia have said no. 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 Thank you, Dreamer Kasey, and Malaysia.